first of all, I season these things so good to the gods. Mmm. -hmm. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Courtney and welcome back to You Thought It Out City. You Thought It Out City. Yep, you thought it, your girl definitely said it. Today we actually did um, some Flaming Heart Cheetos wings. So I actually been wanting to try it because I actually watched it on a couple people's channel. It's so many channels I can't even mention them all because I really don't even know anyways. I just was clicking on stuff. Ooh, let me watch this. So I've been watching it for about two years and I never tried it. So today I said, let me try these wings. Let me see what they really buy, you know. So I got my blue cheese, y'all. Your girl don't eat ranch. I eat ranch, but mm, not for no chicken wings. I'm just not. That's out. I got my pickles because I really do love pickles. Let me see. Yeah, that's what's happening. I love pickles and ranch, but pickles and blue cheese is that deal. Your girl got her Stella Rosa. Wow, you see, you see. Mouth always a little parts, a little thirsty. Mm-hmm. My God. Mm -hmm. It's so chill, baby. It's not gonna be a long video, y'all, because I'm just sampling these wings. I'm actually gonna show y'all how I made them. They actually came out okay. But next time I'm gonna do it a different way just to make sure that my Cheetos was actually sticking, sticking. Just to make sure. So let's get into this video, boo-boo. Let's try these little these little wings, hunty. Now your girl don't really like flats. I like drums. I know. I like drums. So let's try it on. I'm gonna try it without anything first because I don't know. I don't know. First of all, I season these things so good to the gods. Mmm. -hmm. The seasoning though tastes like butter. Mmm. I love spicy stuff, so I'm ready for this right now, okay? Now. For some reason, I was thinking this was gonna be really spicy. It's not at all, at all, at all. So I'm actually gonna try the red. I mean, the blue cheese. Mmm. I ain't gonna lie. That blue cheese though. Hmm. 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 That blue cheese ain't nothing to play with. Ain't nothing like some good ass chicken wings, baby, when you're drunk. With some blue cheese. Sus. <laughs> Sus. About to bust my damn heart open. So good. So good. But anyway, I normally do seafood mud and stuff, but my friend Jarnika said she's tired of seeing the people in the city doing seafood mud bangs. So I'm not doing my bang anymore. I seafood mud bang anymore. At least until it dies down, you know, because when people not doing it, then all of a sudden you can do it again, you know. You know how that goes. You know, first of all, but nah, for real, this is delicious, y'all. 
But it's, it is extremely crunchy. I don't know if y'all like y'all chicken crunchy, but I do not like some crunchy chicken now. Some country fried chicken will kill you. Don't let it be fried correctly. My God. Mm-hmm. I really do be happy, y'all. Mm-hmm. I'm probably gonna better eat all there. And if you don't suck the gristle, you will not eat no chicken wing. You play too much. Give them to me next time, sis. You must clean the gristle. Or you playing over the chicken. You don't got no business eating none of that chicken. Give me that chicken, girl. I hear people be leaving all that good stuff on that chicken, boy. Mmm. Now, if y'all noticed, I do bite my chicken on one side of my mouth. It's my husband's fault. When I met him, he only ate his chicken from the side of his mouth. Like, he only bought, he only bite it like this. Because he had braces. And for some reason, I just started eating like that years ago. And I can't help it now. I rarely bite my chicken with my front teeth. Especially not a flat. Uh -uh. I gotta I gotta bite that kind of differentness. Mm. Ooh. That deal chicken. I mean, this deal pickle. I should have put some. Cheetos on him. Fry them up too. Mm. Oh, wow. All right. I can honestly say I got my $12 worth, y'all. You know, y'all buy, I be buying all this wine and I be like, I be upset. Like, it ain't even good. It's $15. Not even good. Okay, well, this wine is good, y'all. It actually got like a little bubble, a little sizzle to it. You know, a little sizzle in your spirit. Calm that storm. Yes, Lord. It's so good. I like it. I'm going to say my husband in law, Razzle Dallas. Mm hmm. Look, to be honest, y'all, I'm a little full, but I put my mouth on this chicken, so I'm going to eat it. My kids would love to tear it down, but I'm going to eat it. Mm. I'm not full from eating four chicken wings. To be honest, I was eating when I was cooking because I hadn't had breakfast yet and I couldn't wait. You know, I wasn't eating these chicken wings. I cooked some of the hot Cheeto chicken wings and I cooked some buffalo wings, which I decided not to eat on camera. So, yeah. I'm going to show y'all how I made these. Mm. So stay tuned. And guys, I do drop videos every Monday. Every Monday I will be dropping a video. Sometimes I'll be busy, but I'll be trying to get these videos out. For the first time... For the last two weeks, I did not drop multiple videos a week, and I felt really bad. I got to get my life together because that's that's just not that's not where it's at. I feel like a loser. I'll be, I was slacking. And guys, I really, really, really want to come up with a name because I need a gang name. I need y'all to be the gang. Y'all can't be the Maldi gang, the Citronese gang, the somebody gang. Shoot, some type of gang. Shoot, I want a game. Tell me what y'all think my game name should be. Cause I need one. Like ASAP. 
drop in the comments if you ever tried the hot cheeto chicken wings or whatever let me know tell me if y'all like it let me know if y'all gonna try it because let me see if y'all like it or not and thank y'all so much for watching be sure to like comment subscribe and please share your girl channel okay you know we trying to be growing and glowing around here but we can't glow and grow if um, y'all ain't sharing. Let people know, girl, go watch my girl. She real stupid now. But you, you'll you get a little laugh out of that there. She real stupid, though. Yeah. Go tell. Go tell your friend. Go tell your mom. Go tell your grandma. Go tell Auntie Sue. Hell, I don't care who you tell. Tell your husband. Your husband friend. I don't care who you tell. Tell somebody. Tell your parole officer. Tell somebody. Tell your pastor. Tell her she cursed a little bit, but you know, it'll be all right. You'll be all right. Lady over here trying to glow and grow. Can't do that without y'all. Y'all my flossy posse. I don't think I want that to be my name, but you get it though. Y'all help me out. That's all I'm saying. Help me out. Yeah, I'm gonna be drunk because first of all, it's good. It's real good. Mm-hmm. I think it's better than chicken wings then. I don't know about that. But y'all, I do want to thank y'all so much for tuning in. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. As I said before, do not forget about your girl. Share this video. Tell a friend. And we got this bit. Hey guys, this is how I made the chicken. I actually turned my air fryer on 365 to let it warm up. Now I actually have the chicken. I actually cleaned it already, so now I'm actually going to season it. These are the seasons that I'll be using. Garlic powder, lemon pepper, seasoned salt, complete season, my fave, baby, my fave, black pepper. Yes, we seasons over here, okay? No black pepper and no salt over here. We won't be doing that. Not today. Mm-mm. So we're just going to go ahead and season this meat up for y'all. Watch your girl work, you know. Mm -hmm. Sprinkle that little juice, baby. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. A little feather dust. There you go. There you mm -hmm. That's how you do it. Yeah, girl. We almost done. Bear with me a little sack, you know. Mm hmm All right, so we're going to mix that chicken up, you know. We got to make sure them good seasons get on all the chicken. So when you take that first bite, you can feel that thing on no matter what side you're on. Just, my God. We almost there. Go ahead, go ahead and zoom in on that chicken, baby. Nice and seasoned. So much flavor going to be in there. Now we got our eggs. We're going to go ahead and mix that up so that um we can actually use that as the batter we're gonna have to dip the chicken in the eggs so look at it look at it so now we're gonna take the hot cheetos and we're gonna pour them into the nutribullet this is pretty much my blender that we'll be using and we're gonna grind them up so this is the Cheetos bag. This is what we're using, guys, just so you guys know. Just in case y'all don't know. Yeah. All right, so we're going to go ahead and grind them babies up. There you go, girl. That's how you do it. Yes. Yes, sis. All right, we're going to go ahead and pour it on into our little bowl. This, will, this is what we'll be dipping the battered chicken in to coat it, pretty much. We're going to be coating the wings with hot Cheetos. All right, so we're going to go ahead and dip our chicken into the egg batter. This is what makes the hot Cheetos thick, guys. Of course, we need some damn batter. Everybody needs batter. So here's the batter. I started to put some buttermilk on my chicken, but I changed my mind. I don't like smelling that shit. Stink. Mm-hmm. So we're just going to go ahead and dip that chicken into the Cheetos. Look at it. Nice, pretty, and red. 
Yeah, dip it, you know. Toss that salad all up in now. Mm hmm. Look how nice and pretty it looks. Then we're just gonna place it. I suppose I have a cookie sheet, but uh, -uh. we're gonna place it over here on this lid. You know, because that's the closest thing to me. And then we're gonna just continue to do that. Get some chicken, toss that thing all up in now. Toss it, toss it, toss it. Toss it all up in that batter. And then once it's good and tossed, we're going to put it over there in them Cheetos. Ugh. <laughs> yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. no. There you go. Just toss it all up in now. Now we're going to go ahead and put it over there and toss it in that tip. So it can be nice and coated. Now I can tell y'all, y'all can double coat this. So pretty much y'all could actually... Toss them in the egg yolk first and then go back and coat them. Then you can toss them again and coat them again. I did not do that because in my head it really wasn't necessary. But I have seen other people do it on their channel. So do it however you see fit, you know? Because obviously that's what I did. Mm -hmm. Just place it on over there. It looks really good, though, for real. I was kind of anxious as I was making this. Like, oh, my God, I hope it's good. Like, I wonder what it's going to taste like. I was just running myself raggedy. Period. So, we are almost done. I actually had a lot of chicken to do. So, I only recorded a couple pieces. So, y'all can understand exactly what I did, how I did it. And y'all didn't have no real questions, you know? So... I'm trying to speed that thing up for y'all a piece. All right, guys. So now I'm actually about to put them in the deep fryer so get ready guys and i had just bought this thing so i really don't even know how to use it so whatever i know enough drop them babies in that basket drop it in that oil let it cook let it ride don't hate don't judge me i can sing a little bit okay Anyways, you see how you just place them in the rack? Mm-hmm. Place them in that rack, girl. Don't miss a beat. Because you know they watching. Don't miss a beat. There you, there you go. Put it in now. Yes. Drop them babies down in that grease. Mm-hmm. You see the grease turning red and all. I got to pull all the grease out when I'm done. Damn. All right. Now, oh, look at the chicken bit. Okay. All right. Chicken is done. We are removing them from the basket. We're actually going to put them in another basket so it can drain. Once this chicken drain, it's on. It's on. Just know that. Because it's time to eat, eat, baby. We almost there. Hey, look at your girl. I guess I did my thing thing. <laughs> 